On September 17th, Azerbaijan's first lady, president of the Heydar Aliyev Foundation, Mehriban Aliyeva, came to the UNESCO headquarters and had a meeting with UNESCO Director General Irina Bokova. They stressed the importance of joint projects between the country and the organization, presentation on Gobostan at UNESCO, and expressed confidence that the bilateral ties would be further enhanced. Speaking at the ceremony prior to the shadows of Gobostan Ballet, UNESCO Director General Irina Bokova once more welcomed Azerbaijan's first lady, Mehriban Aliyeva. She called Gobostan a masterpiece of the Azerbaijani people and the world cultural heritage and hailed the event as a moral bridge and an important element of the bilateral cooperation. Culture and Tourism Minister Abil Fazkarayev said much had been done and projects were being implemented to preserve Kobustan, the national wealth of our people. He said museum built at Kobustan State Historical Artistic Preserve was opened in December 2011 with the participation of President Ilham Aliyev and his spouse Mehriban Aliyeva. The minister underlined that shadows of Kobustan saw its international premiere in Paris 45 years ago and added that returning to this issue in the French capital was an outstanding contribution to art lovers there. Following this, Shadows of Kobustan Ballet was demonstrated. Shadows of Kobustan Ballet was composed by great Azerbaijani composer Faraj Kuliyev. First stage in 1969, Shadows of Kobustan Ballet later had a success in Paris, Nice, Luxembourg, Monte Carlo, St. Petersburg, Kiev and other cities. Shadows of Gobustan, which is a one-act ballet, consists of four short novels. Though Gobustan is known to the science for a long time, the history linking UNESCO with this important historical monument is not in the remote past. Gobustan was inscribed in the World Heritage List in 2007 and is among the masterpieces of the world cultural heritage. This historical monument is still attracting attention of foreign scientists. A number of projects are being implemented to promote Gobustan in the world and Azerbaijan's first Lady Mehriban Aliyeva is attaching special importance to the cooperation with UNESCO, number one cultural organization of the world. One of the reasons why the world science takes interest in Gobustan Monument is that human life began here approximately in the 10th millennium BC and lasted till the 18th century. One of the disputable issues is language of the ancient people in Gobustan, but the inscriptions give unique information about them and their living. Tambourine stone is used in the ballet. Tambourine stone is a great invention of the ancient residents of Gobustan. As part of Gobustan's promotion, a photo exhibition was also opened at the UNESCO headquarters. Addressing the ceremony, UNESCO Assistant Director General for Culture, Alfredo Perez, said Gobustan was a masterpiece of the world cultural heritage. Minister of Culture and Tourism, Abul Fazgarayev, drew attention to Gobustan's role in UNESCO-Azerbaijan cooperation. He said inclusion of the historical monument into the world heritage list was of great importance. As seen on the photos, most of the inscriptions were engraved on large rocks sometimes on old paintings. Initially, the inscriptions were life-size animals and humans. Later, they were diminished in size. Old rock inscriptions have preserved tangible cultural examples created by our ancestors for millenniums and presented Gobostan, the historical monument, to the mankind.